I told y'all, I told y'all that uh, friends don't let friends be state fans. And uh, there's a reason why. Michigan just dominated the overtime. And uh, <laughs> it went down to a last second goal by Michigan. Literally last second. Um, I'm riding a high. Uh, Michigan basketball put me on a low. <laughs> now I'm back up. What an amazing game. It started off with a, a penalty in the first period. There's a long time, 16 minutes, where there's a bunch of nothing. And then a penalty on uh, Michigan State. Michigan got a power play goal by Helm and uh, or Hughes. Uh, I think it was deflected, and then Helm got the shot. But one nothing Michigan. MSU then got a goal with a minute 50 left, so it was 1-1. Shots were 8-6. to six. Uh, a penalty on Michigan State with 115 left in the period. And uh, then the period ended, and there was a Hallam penalty uh, after review. So uh, just Michigan with plenty of bad passes now and an un uneventful for the first seven minutes. And then Michigan got a penalty early in the second period. Portillo had some saves, but Michigan State got a goal on a power play. It was 2-1 Michigan State. 30 seconds later after that, uh, uh, Dylan Duke got a goal, which made it 2-2. There was 11 minutes left in the second period. Michigan was on a 3-on-1 and got a goal by Nazar. So it was 3-2 <laughs> about a minute after their last goal. 10:09 left in the second period. Shots now were 14 to 11 Michigan. Uh, a glove save by Portillo and then a faceoff win. Uh, 20 Michigan led the faceoffs 20 to 18 at that point with eight minutes and 45 seconds left in the second period. Portillo was working hard, working hard all game long, but especially during this stretch right here, Michigan struggled to get it into the Michigan State zone for a long time and then eventually Michigan State had a penalty with six minutes left in the second period and Michigan State kills that penalty. Uh, Michigan then got a penalty with 249 left in the period. Shots are now 14 to 15 Michigan State. With 16 seconds left on the kill, another Michigan penalty on Edwards. So it was five on three for uh, 16 seconds and then five on four again for a while, but it was the end of the second period and uh, 56 seconds left for Michigan State on the power place to start the third period shots were 17 to 14 Michigan State, but the score was still three to two Michigan uh, Michigan kills that power play early in the third period and another nice save by for Portillo shots were 19 to 14 Michigan State so, you know, just a bombardment. Portillo had a great game. Uh, another heavy pressure uh, and more saves for Portillo. Shots were now 22 to 15, Michigan State. Portillo is holding his own. 15 minutes left in the, uh, in Michigan finally controlled in the Michigan State zone for a while. <laughs> and eventually they got a Michigan State penalty with 11.58 left. Michigan had plenty of shots, but Sincere was blocking them all and saving them all. Uh, Michigan State's goalie, and he killed it. Killed the penalty. There was a TV timeout with 9 minutes and 34 seconds left. Michigan still leads 3-2, to two, but shots are now uh, Michigan State 26-2, Michigan's 22. There is now 5 minutes and 48 seconds left. Shots are 28-2. Uh, 23 so a whole lot of nothing really there for four minutes Michigan State then got a goal with four minutes and 55 seconds left which tied the game at three MSU was still winning time of possession and shots with three minutes and 20 seconds left a late barrage of shots by Michigan was unsuccessful and then a hand pass was called on Michigan with a minute left both teams couldn't do anything in the last minute, even though Michigan had a couple more opportunities. And the game goes to overtime. 
in overtime, or at the start of overtime, the shots were Michigan State 33 to Michigan's 26. So I was a little bit worried, of course. And it went back and forth. Chances for both teams early. 304 left in overtime. Michigan got a penalty, but Michigan controlled most of that penalty shorthanded and had an opportunity or two. And they killed that penalty. And then with just barely seconds left, they were full strength again. Uh, Michigan got the puck and scored <laughs> and scored with the last second and the last one second of the game. What an unbelievable game. Um, in Detroit with 18,000 spectators watching this game uh, at Little Caesars, it was an unbelievable performance. Michigan swept Michigan State this weekend. And uh, they don't get the three points because it went to overtime, but hopefully they can end up with that uh, two spot in the Big Ten tournament going forward and get the home field advantage. Uh, it was an unbelievable performance. I still have yet to go look at all the, uh, the stats for people. And I think this whole, whole thing was without Adam Fantilli because of his uh, game misconduct. I think he was suspended. So... What a gritty performance by Michigan. The rivalry is there. But like I said, friends, don't let friends be state fans. Come on over to the blue side. <laughs> Go blue, everybody.